Knowing exactly what the rotor head speed is on your RC helicopter can be a great tool for tuning it. I'm still new to flying helicopters, but the Chinook Optical Tachometer has made tuning my helicopter up a lot easier. More experienced pilots usually know that they're only guessing when they think they can hear a certain RPM. This is the window that you look through, and controlling the speed of that slotted disc is what tells us the RPM of the rotor head. The dial to the right increases or decreases the speed of that slotted disc in 10 RPM increments. And when that slotted disc gets up to its basic speed, this display on the LCD changes to an RPM. And that tells you that you're ready to start measuring the RPM of your rotor head. You turn the Chinook on and off with this rocker switch on top, and I found out you want to be careful of that when you put it away. I apparently wasn't careful enough, and somehow in the box it got turned on, and when I got to the field I found out that the battery was dead. This unit is powered by a 9 volt battery that you supply, and getting it in and out of this tight case can be a little difficult, but it can be done. I'm not a big fan of getting too close to any size helicopter, so the Chinook makes a lot of sense. This is looking through that window with the slotted wheel spinning. The movement of the Chinook is me increasing the speed by 10 RPM. Now I finally get it where it starts backing up, and I back it up one click, and that shows me that my rotor head was turning 2870 RPM. So if you want to know what your rotor head speed is, and you don't want to get too close to measure it, you need to take a look at the Chinook Optical Tachometer G2.